What's going on, my beautiful necessary? What's good? Today we are back and we're watching the B movie for the very first time. Yes, I have never seen this movie before. Excited to see what it's all about. Shout out to everybody that's currently watching the premiere. How you doing? How you looking? How you smelling? I hope you're doing, looking, and smelling amazing. Your boy is doing and looking pretty good. And I'm currently smelling like Latafa Assad. No, this is not sponsored, but since I asked y'all what y'all smell like, I figured I would tell you what I smell like. We may not do this forever, all right? Even though I'm not gonna hold you, I could. But at some point, we'll stop. But for now, that's what I smell like. No, it's not sponsored. If you haven't been told this, you matter. And I love you. I really do, for real. Make sure that y'all drink y'all water and stay hydrated. We've done plenty of talking for this intro. We're gonna do more talking for this video. So if that's not your thing, go ahead and get up out of here. But let's get straight into the B-movie. I love how DreamWorks like literally makes their intro special for whatever the movie it is. Like they always include the character in the intro credit. That's so dope to me. According to all known laws of aviation. Is that Morgan Freeman? No way. Its wings are too small to get its fat little body off the ground. I never even thought about that. The wings are small. Because bees don't care what humans think is impossible. Hmm. I don't know if that's necessarily how that works, but okay, <laughs> I guess. Ain't no way my boy got more sneakers than I do. And they're the same shoes over and over and over again. A black, yellow, black, yellow, See, black, this makes black, getting black, dressed yeah. so much easier. No way, this man used honey for his hair and he gargled it. And he's using it for deodorant? Breakfast is ready. How old is Harry? That's my first question. And secondly, is that your mama? Cause your mama is thicky. Her little stinger got a little banger on her. You hear me? That's hilarious. That's funny. That is funny. Yo, his voice sounds so familiar, but I can't figure out what his name is. Here's the graduate. We're very proud of you, son. His daddy looked like Elvis if he was a B. Wave to us. We'll be in row 118,000. Huh? 118 thou wow? Goodness gracious. Oh, that was hard. I like that. That was hard. Jerry Seinfeld is his name. That's who I couldn't figure out. I was like, yo, his voice sounds so familiar. Never seen a Seinfeld show or, what, or whatever show he was on. Did y'all watch the show that Jerry was on? Three days of grade school, three days of high school, three days of college. You mean to tell me it only took you like a week and some change to graduate? What? If only school could have actually been like that for me, I might have enjoyed going. Everybody knows just think someone you die. You don't waste it on a squirrel. Dang, when I think about bees' lives, like they really do have to make it count because if they sting somebody one time, that's it, they're gone. So the turnover rate for bees are super high. Woohoo! I love this incorporating the amusement park right into our regular day. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I would call that an amusement park, but okay. And I didn't know that Chris Rock is in this movie, so I know that it's gonna be funny. I love how they're graduating inside of a honeycomb. Like, I love that. What if a, like a human came and smacked that joker? Yeah, and that concludes our graduation ceremonies. That's, <laughs> man, if all graduations could be like that, I'd probably go to every single one. Some graduations be lasting way too long. Orientation. Huh. Whoa, heads up, here we go. Oh, now I see why they graduate so fast because they have to get to work immediately. That makes so much sense. <laughs> okay, all right. A division of Honesco and a part of the Hexagon Group. I love the names that they're using. Honex, Honexico. It's hard, I like it. To get to the point where you can work for your whole- Now y'all see all that honey right there? That's what some of y'all ears look like because y'all ain't cleaned y'all ears in a long time. Yeah, I'm talking about you, nasty self. You ain't even wash your face this morning. Go brush your teeth, just nasty. I don't understand y'all, for real. Get your hygiene together. But thank you for being here. Hit that thumbs up button, also drink water. Thank you. That girl was hot. She's my cousin. Oh, that's Girls awkward. Wait, bees are all cousins? How does that work? These bees are stress testing a new helmet technology. Oh, they're trying to survive. That's hilarious. <laughs> You're not beating the shoe. The bee is a cockroach? No way you're beating the shoe with that helmet. Oh, they hit him with a combination. What kind of helmet is that? Shoot, maybe if I had that helmet, I wouldn't have a kid. <laughs> it's a little adult joke, you know? Just, no, that was inappropriate, yeah. And I don't even know if I said adult joke properly. Like, the words got jumbled up in my tongue. You'll stay in the job that you pick for the rest of your life. That sounds so miserable. No way. What's the difference? Huh? Oh, so I think I just figured out what the premise of this movie is. He's gonna be the only bee that wants to journey out to find something new to do or something. So you'll just work us to death? We'll sure try. <laughs> they laughing, they're NPCs. 
They don't even, like she just told you, they're gonna work you to death and you're fine with that? I would've been like, yeah, no, I quit. Yeah, see, cause they got this looking like Willy Wonka before they went to the uh, factory and all them kids started missing. What's the difference? Adam, how could you say that? One job forever? See, I can't get on, I can't, I can't deal with that. No, I need other options. Don't tell me that this is the only thing I can do. I'm gonna figure something else out. No, that's beautiful. I wish that real life was like that cause traffic sucks. I cannot stay in traffic. You wanna see me mad? Sitting in traffic. Hey, those are pollen jocks. Wow. Wait, pollen jocks? I've never heard of that. Is that a real thing or did they just make it up for the movie? Hey, John. Of course, they get all the chicken heads. Of course they do. <laughs> yeah. Oh, first of all, they making this honey look real good. You guys did great. <laughs> He put on the aviator shades. I wonder where those guys have just been. I don't know. Wait, I wonder I wonder if he's gonna try to try out for the, the, the joggers or whatever their names is. You can't just decide one day to be a pollen jock. Oh, pollen jock. That's what it is. That's more pollen than you and I will ever see in a lifetime. It's just a status symbol. See, he says that because he's a loser. See, he wouldn't be able to hang out with me. I don't hang out with losers. Sorry, buddy. Those ladies? Oh, aren't they our cousins too? Distant, distant. Oh, now they distant when you want to talk to them. Of course. One time a bear had me pinned up against a mushroom. Oh, uh, my boy is perpetrating. Why are you lying? Back and forth across the <laughs> He actually slapped this man. <laughs> a sunflower patch about six miles from here tomorrow. Maybe you're not up for it. Maybe I am. Let's go, Harry. Go ahead. Come on, talk with your chest player. Oh, 900, we there. Don't worry about it. Are you be enough? I might be. Shoot, I would've let him know, like, look, I let my stinger hang, you heard me? All right, I'm about that buzz, 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 like, stop playing with him. And some of y'all thought I was talking about y'all rose. I'm not. I know y'all heard buzz, buzz, and you went looking. Is it charged? Is it? Relax. Oh, Barry, you are so funny sometimes. I'm not trying to be funny. It's so funny because all of the girl bees look exactly the same, just a different wig. I can say anything I want right now. Right. Maybe I'll pierce my thorax. <laughs> Shack up with the grasshopper. Let's shack up with the grasshopper. Get a gold tooth and start calling everybody dogs. I'm so proud. Oh, not the dog. Congratulations, son. Step to the side, please. Yeah. His voice sounds familiar, too. Dang, it bothers me when I can't figure out who's voicing these characters. We are ready. Well, step up and make your choice. Bro, that's moving way too fast. My vision, I wouldn't be able to pick a good job. Restroom attendance always open, and not for the reason you think. Uh-uh. I know why it's uh, still available. Well, whenever a bee dies, that's an opening. Oh, that's how that works. <laughs> I love how they just keep it pushing, though. They're like, bees die every day. Bees die every day. Sunflower patch in 209. What happened to you? Where are you? I love how they talk on the phone. They just pull their antennas down. That's so dope. You're gonna die. You're crazy. See, that's exactly what it's like when you're trying to share your dreams with NPCs. They tell you that you crazy. It's not gonna work. Stop listening to them haters. Had I listened, y'all wouldn't be watching me today. I'm telling you, you wouldn't. Now fast forward, these same people that told me it wasn't gonna work, now they asking me for advice. what they say? God will make your enemies your footstool or your step stool, your stepping stone, your ladder. Y'all know what I'm trying to say, man, forget it. Absolutely no talking to humans. Y'all don't talk to humans. Y'all just buzz in our damn ears. I cannot stand the sound that bees and flies make. Like that buzzing noise in my ear, like it really makes me want to fight a joker. Win, Jack. Antenna, check. Nectar pack, check. How are y'all checking the wind when you're still inside the honeycomb, though? It looked like everybody else got, like, motors on their backs, but he just has his own regular stingers. I mean, uh, rings. I love how he saluted them. I love how he saluted. Yeah, he had to like Woody and um, Buzz when they were falling out the sky. I mean, or falling with style, whatever. Yeah, that's too many bees conjugating for me though. I would get out of that park expeditiously. Oh, spelling bee, since I said expeditiously, since it's been a while since I've done one, let's go ahead and do it. Y'all got faith? You shouldn't, let's go. Okay, expeditious. I think I tried to spell this word before. Expeditions, y'all remember those things? They were like mini buses, you know? My boy had like a family full of like 17 people. I seen them like stacked on top of each other like Legos. I'm like, damn, how you fit that many kids? Anyways, expeditiously. Expa, expo. 
exposed, which I hope never happens to me. Expeditious, expeditiously. E X P X P E D expeditious. I T I O U S L Y expeditiously. I don't even know if that was the original word that I was supposed to be spelling, but stay in school. Oh, that is one nectar collector. Nectar collector <laughs> is a crazy, like, combination of words. Like, I'm just trying to find my girl that's willing to be a nectar collector. You see what I did there? You like it? You didn't like it. Okay. <laughs> Bro, he's really not even working. He's just out there having a joy ride. Like, he would be fired messing with me. And he's the only one I don't have a nectar collector. Now I think about it. Are you reporting a moving flower? Affirmative. Wait, those aren't flowers. Those are tennis balls. They're about to end up getting smacked. Fuzzy. Chemically. Oh, oh, he's stuck. B. Hey, uh, candy brain, get off there. Problem? Oh, it's done. Damn, of course, out of everybody, it will be you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was hard. Point. Bro, is he, does he, does he do a voiceover on Family Guy? His voice sounds familiar too. Oh, oh, oh man, I thought bro was over with. I thought that fan was about to shred him up like some taco meat. Yeah. That boy about to freeze, you better get out of there. Oh man, they're about to get into a car accident. Yo, if there was a bee in your car while you were driving, what would happen? Would you calmly just roll the window down or would you be panicked? Let me know. I think I've actually had a bee in my car one time, and but he was just flying around in the back, so I just kind of let, I let him hang out. We went for our drive that day, honestly. He blinked! <laughs> hey, Grandma, you gonna choke everybody with that spray. I gotta get home. Whoa. Oh, it's raining. Oh, for whatever reason, I thought like the, the spray was in the air. Can't fly in rain. Can't fly in rain. Can't fly in rain. Wait, bees can't fly in rain? I guess I never knew that. They don't be out when it's raining. I'm learning. I I really didn't even, I real life did not know that. Be going down. Also, another dumb question, but what do bees eat? Do they eat honey? I, I fell first grade, so help me out, all right? Don't judge me, just help me. Maybe this time. This time, 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 this time. This, this is what y'all look like making the same mistake over and over and over again. That's exactly what it looks like. Even my top 10 favorite movies. Is he gonna end up getting adopted by this family? How did all of the places he could have ended up, he ended up at their house? No wonder we're not supposed to talk to them. They're out of their minds. <laughs> we are. We definitely are. I don't remember the sun having a big 75 on it. Damn. Okay. Oh, not in a guacamole. Oh, no. Bro, you gotta get rid of the whole guacamole. Like, the whole thing. Why does his life have any less value than yours? I would've looked at her and said, step back, step back. Ow, stomped on him. I'll tell you what though, his wife is fine. That's what I do know. I'd be like, look baby, you gorgeous, right? But go in the room, go in the room. Cause what I'm about to do, you ain't gonna watch. You're not gonna wanna see this. Wait, is this bee gonna fall in love with her? Don't tell me this is a love story of a bee and a human. Don't, don't tell me that what this movie is about. You know, knocking someone out is also a special skill. Knocking someone out is a special skill. I agree. Whoa. Yeah, that's what you get, wet behind the ear, boy. He's sitting out there simping. <laughs> oh, I didn't even realize that it was a bubble bee on there. That's so funny. <laughs> I could really get in trouble. Did bro really just sacrifice his whole life? He he really is doing this. Do it. I can't. How should I start it? Man, you had all that time last night. You should have wrote her a song called I Can't Believe Your Love. Y'all see what I believe? No, I be trying. Very disconcerting. Yeah, I mean, this is a bit of a surprise to me. Wait a minute, he's having a conversation with her and she understands him? Oh! Wait, oh. what is she doing? How did you learn to do that? The talking thing. Mama, Dada, honey, you pick it up. <laughs> what? Bees are funny. Huh. We didn't laugh, we'd cry with what we have to deal with. Actually, I can see how that can be a thing because your guys' life's low key, especially like life expectancy is kind of sad. Takes two minutes. Really? It's just coffee. I hate to impose. Don't be ridiculous. I'm gonna be honest with you. I come in to my house and my wife is talking to a bee in the kitchen. She ain't gonna be my wife no more. <gasps> it is what it is. I tell her and that bee they can go together. Why would I marry a watermelon? 
<laughs> it wasn't funny, bro. It wasn't. I know how you feel. You do? Yeah, she been wanting to get a divorce from her husband. My only interest is flowers. Our new queen was just elected with that same campaign slogan. That's funny. That is funny. Lost a toe ring there. Once. Really? Yes. Why do girls put rings on their toes? Yeah, wait, hold on. Y'all be putting rings on y'all toes? That's a thing? I've never known anybody to have a toe ring. Oh, he is really falling in love. Oh, wow. This is weird. Oh, very weird concept for a movie. Okay. Here, have a crop. Ooh, thanks. Yeah. You better be careful now. Don't let this man start asking for crumbs from your underwear. <laughs> I love the fact that they got on like lab coats. They got the button up and the tie. <laughs> that dude may not die from getting his stinger pulled or whatever, but he's for sure gonna die in one of these experiments. See out there, you had your experience. Yo, that little thing in the background? That was hard. I like it. You know, I'm not attracted to the spiders. I know that everyone else is like the hottest thing with the eight legs and all. No, eight legs don't even seem like it's all that attractive for real. That's a bee law. You wouldn't break a bee law. Her name's Vanessa. Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. Yep. I ain't never met one nice Vanessa. I have yet to meet her. Every Vanessa that I have ever met has been a problem. But not you, Vanessa. The one that's watching this video, you're not a problem at all. I know that you're a great person. Yeah. This is over. Eat this. Bro, no way you stuffing something in my mouth talking about eat this. Do you know what a Cinnabon is? No. They really had an ad put in this movie. Cinnabon. They're really good, but they are way too sweet for me now. But I used to love getting one of those. I eat one now, I'm gonna have a headache for days. Thinking B. Thinking B. Thinking B. Thinking B. Thinking B? Are they gang banging? They said, whoa. <laughs> you know what your problem is, Barry? I gotta start thinking B. <laughs> He's sitting chilling in the pool like this is the graduate. You have no job, you barely a B. Well, first of all, what is what does your dad do? Cause I don't even see him work. This dude is simping so hard right now. It's not even funny. But she look good in that yellow dress though. I will say that. She got the B simping and she got Billy simping. You heard me? I love how they made that a joke with her killing. I, I love that. Oh, not her playing with her hair. Don't be too long. You better stop talking to me like that before I give you a reason to holler. Watch this. Imagine she fell out the sky. What can it be do for you then? She better not make off hard. Yes, 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 yes. yes. Yes! Even though it was a daydream, that still was good. I love it. Oh, to be in the Tournament of Roses. That's every florist's dream. Hey, is there any uh, florists watching this video right now? Let me know, I'm curious. I wanna find out what type of occupations you guys are working out there. Uh, TiVo, you can just freeze live TV? Another commercial? Does TiVo still exist? <laughs> <laughs> she actually smacked him up? 75 is pretty much our limit. Boy, you've really got that down to a science. They have to, yeah. Golden Blossom, Ray Liotta <laughs> Private Select. Who is Ray Liotta? That seems like it's a real person. Bees make it. I know who makes it. <laughs> Look, he upset. He is upset. He's like, you know how much time it takes for us to get this, honey? And y'all just come and rob us? Like, when I think about it, we are gangster for that. Like, for real. And it's on sale? <laughs> I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. <laughs> <laughs> he said, and it's on sale? Oh no. He is here. Well, I guess I'll go home now. Oh, he's baiting him. Out with no one around. This man hit the moonwalk going forward in place. That was hard. Too late. It's ours now. <laughs> you, sir. Sword fighting with a bee is insane. Where is the honey coming from? Tell me where. Honey farm. He wouldn't have been able to punk me. I would have been like, go ahead, do it. Cause I know that you die after this, so do it. You bad. Show me you bad. <laughs> yeah, that looked just like when Woody was trying to grab Slink's leg. It looked exactly like that. It's so funny though, cause after watching this movie, like it's making me want honey. Like I see honey so much and I don't even really eat honey like that. Just keep still. What? You're not dead? Is that Chris? That's Chris Rock? I'm going to Tacoma. What about you? He really is dead. <laughs> he really is dead. How much do you people need to see? Open your eyes. 
<laughs> I love that. That is so great. Hey, what's up, B boy? Hey, <laughs> Did he say A hey, blood? They gang banging in here? No way they will whooping. Not us, man. We we on our own. Every, every mosquito on his own. Why is this mosquito dressed like a pimp named Slickback? Can somebody tell me that? People see a mosquito smack smack. Yeah, I can't stand mosquitoes, bro. I cannot. Mosquito girls try to trade up. Get with a moth. Oh my goodness. Mosquito girls trade up. Lord have mercy. He's got a brain the size of a pinhead. They are pinheads. I love how they're making it seem like humans really just be sitting here thinking about and talking about bees like that. They literally just steal their honey and keep it pushing. There's no other thought with it. They make the honey and we make the money. I knew that was coming. Mm-hmm. It's, it's a good saying though. Now think about it, humans really monetize everything, bro. Like we even pay for air. We pay for damn water. I love how it looks like they're living, well, it looks like they in jail. That don't look like, I was gonna say like, like it looked like they're in condos, but that looked like a full on jail. This is your queen? That's a man in woman's clothes. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh Lord, they go cancel the B movie. Oh Lord, they go cancel the B movie. This is worse than anything the bears have done to us. Where did he get this camera from? And how did he develop them pictures? I just want to know who helped him. When did he have time to go to CVS? Sarah didn't take him. He has a human girlfriend. Oh, Barry. And they make out. Make out? Oh, he putting on extras. That's what I would do though. That That's how I do it. San Antonio, man, those crazy legs kept me up all night. Not those crazy legs kept me up all night. And San Antonio? Woo! I had some good times in San Antonio. I had some crazy legs keep me up. No. I had some crazy legs up. Never mind. There's only one place you can sting the humans. One place where it really matters. Where is that at? Where it really matters? I don't I don't know where he plans on, in the butt? Yo, one time my little sister, she got stung on the butt like cause it was a bee in the car and like he was on the seat or something. Stung her, got her. Sports with Buzz Larvey and Jeanette Chung. Yo, this intro is so hard. Dang, that was hard. Don't forget to- Be Larry King? That's great. That is so great. And it looks just like him too. I mean, what about B. Columbus? B. Gandhi? B. Jesus? But Jesus is insane. Ken, she's 81. <laughs> oh, this is where that meme came from? I'm helping him sue the human race. Wow. Oh. <laughs> I cannot, it jacks me up when I see like where the, the original memes come, or the memes that I see all over the place, like where they come from. That's crazy. People are giving balloon bouquets now. Bro, I would not want him floating in my coffee and touching my straw. Hate those fake plastic things. There's nothing worse than a daffodil that's had work done. <laughs> I, I see the double entendre. I see it. When I'm done with the humans, they won't be able to say, honey, I'm- That's funny. That's good. That is really good. Honey, I'm home. Does anybody even actually say that? I, like I've never got the chance to say it. So um, I'm looking for a honey. Let me know. DMs are open, by the way. Follow me. My Instagram right there. At Billy Benjis. Yeah. Looking for a honey so I can say, honey, I'm home. Let this man pull up in a Bugatti? A Maserati? And I love how his license plate said, Ali by. I love that. What are we in? Get out? This man come in storing his tea? Any of you boys work on this? Oh, he's disrespectful for bringing a honey packet in. That's what I would do. Barry B. Benson versus the honey industry is now in session. I wanna know, how does the bees have this much right to take, to sue anybody? That's crazy. Like, no way. No way he's not gonna talk. I'm why kidding, are you? Oh, okay, I was yes, like, what? Honor, we're ready to proceed. And why is everybody acting like this is normal? If I were to hear a bee talk, it's over with. You're dead. Gentlemen of the jury. <laughs> jury. Is this the dude from Roseanne? Is that him? But he also sounds like like Hercules' daddy. I have to negotiate with the silkworm for the elastic in my britches. <laughs> they could be using laser bees. Uh oh, here they go. That's some real stuff right there. They're letting y'all know that not everything is real. Hidden message. I hope your eyes, your third eye, open. Yes, conspiracy Bill has entered the chat. You're not only taking away everything we have, but everything we are. Oh, I wish he would dress like that all the time. <laughs> I can't get over how thick his mama is. 
beekeeper. I find that to be a very disturbing term I have. I bet you do. It's probably offensive. I'm sorry, I couldn't hear you. N no. Oh, he is a really good, where did he go to school at? He only went to school for seven days. How did you get in beat? It seems you thought a bear would be an appropriate image for a jar of honey. I never even thought about that. Why is a bear for honey? You mean like this? Oh, oh, he's playing. He really thought this out. <laughs> okay, that's enough. Take him away. <laughs> <laughs> he really has a good case right now. I'm upset that I'm on his side. I was with a band called the police. But you've never been a police officer of any kind, have you? Oh, I see what his point is. He has a really good argument. Oh, that's good. I see what he's doing. Congratulations on your Emmy win for a guest spot on ER in 2000. Wait, is this a joke? Does anybody know who this guy is? handsome, but with a churning inner turmoil that's always ready to blow. Now he looks like a crazy person. I'm not gonna hold you. This is a bad fella. <laughs> oh, this man really tried to kill him in court? Do you not care about being held in contempt? Okay, so I'm just glad that they didn't make this all about like a love story between a bee and a human. I am happy about that. She better not leave her husband for this bee or I'm a bee <laughs> off. Great team. <laughs> <laughs> well, hello. Oh, here we go. I didn't think you were coming. You didn't think he was coming? I tried to call, but the battery. I like the way he said that. I called Barry. Luckily, he was free. Yeah. Wait, you called him in place of your husband? I find the ball a little grabby. <laughs> <laughs> and he's sitting in your spot. Your wife got to go. And she got to call me. So I can make it juicy for her. Call me. We certainly have that in common. Do we? Yo, he always makes the most like, like he looks physically disgusted. His facial expressions are on point. I let Barry borrow your razor for his fuzz. You let him borrow what? Without asking me? You know, you know, I've just about had it. Oh, he's about to get rid of that man with that magazine. Something stinks in here. I love the smell of flowers. Oh, he don't even care. He is not bothered. Off flames. Oh, snap. Not as much. Ah! That's gangsta. You gonna burn your whole bathroom up though? Bro, that remodel's gonna be so expensive. Like, it's not even worth it. Oh, oh. oh don't tell me he gonna flush him down the toilet. You're bluffing, <laughs> You're bluffing. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> this man's really about to surf the toilet. Up, dude. Oh, poo water. oh yeah, no, not on my face. Not on my face. I would immediately be like, you know what? You won this. I'm gonna go wash my face. The nicest bee I've met in a long time. Oh my goodness. I'd be like, okay, well, be your way out the house. B. My nerves are fried from riding on this emotional roller coaster. Well, that 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 is your fault, bro. 100% that's your fault. Free artificial sweeteners made by man. <laughs> I love, he plays angry so well. I like it! That was so, the animators went so wild for that. That was like scary good. It was almost like he said it in real life. Are you allergic? Only to losing, son. Only to losing. Oh, he about to do something real scummy. Relationship to that woman. <gasps> oh, here we go. We getting personal. This isn't Are about her little <clears throat> boo thing. Uh... Bed bug? I didn't see that coming. Hold me back. <laughs> Hold me back. And don't y'all late your cousins? Wait, no way he put his booty out. Adam Dunn, oh, he purposely wants. got him gassed up just so he could do this. He's seen it. Oh, he actually stabbed him. Oh, I'm here. Oh, no. And here he go with the theatrics. That's what I would do. 100%. That's how you know he was losing. He had to he had to pull out all of the dramatics. Suck the poison from my healing. Oh yeah, no, you you just gonna have to go, bro, cause ain't nobody sucking no poison from your buttocks. You better call your wife to do it. You get somebody else to do it. It ain't gonna be me. Don't tell me they put this beat. Oh my goodness, no, no, come, bro. Why does this bee have better treatment than I do as a human? Like, there's no way he he paid a copay for his insurance. I know that he didn't. Look at me. He got it from the cafeteria. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, that's so funny. Adam, they check in, but they don't check out. <laughs> that's why I don't do motels. I do not. 
bees don't smoke, but some bees are smoking. Adam, that's it. The fact that he is alive is still, I don't know, blowing my mind. Like, how did he make it for real? How much longer are we going to allow? What? Why is this man in a baby walker? You want a smoking gun? Here is your smoking gun. I love how she stepped up like she was a, a Charlie's Angels or something. Honey they really got bees out here fighting the power. Man. Not to the white man. And oh my goodness. And then the one black dude separated himself. There is nothing that this movie will not top. So this was a bunch of comedians who got together and made this movie. That's the only way that this became a thing. I see why DreamWorks never did it again. I wish that they would though. You'll regret this. Oh, I wonder if B2 was gonna be about him getting his revenge. Barry, who are you wearing? Uh, my sweater's Ralph Lauren and I have no pants. Ralph Lauren? Man's got a more name brand than me? Then we want to get back all the honey that was ours to begin with. Every last drop. Y'all wouldn't want the hun- the- Y'all wouldn't want the honey that's being made today. I don't know why I can't talk no more. Wait for my signal. No way they got a fake Winnie the Pooh and Piglet? That's so funny. <laughs> Dang, why y'all doing that to my grandma though? You don't gotta be so aggressive. Shut down, honey production! What do we do now? They don't have nothing to do. They're gonna terrorize the humans. That's what's gonna happen. Yep, flowers start dying. Mm hmm. Everything goes out of whack when y'all ain't producing y'all honeys. Yeah, it's not gonna be good for the earth over time. You see? Y'all didn't even think about the, the consequences of, of the decision that you made. I heard your Uncle Carl was on his way to San Antonio with a cricket. <laughs> That man said, I get to go chill with my chicken head or my cricket head. This was my new desk. This was my new job. See, this is what happens when you don't fully understand how things work. You might think that going this far to the extreme is for the better or for the best or whatever, but then you find out it doesn't work out like how you thought. And the truth is you might not even thought that far. What did you want to show me? This. Yeah, look how miserable those flowers look. And whose fault do you think that is? Whose fault? Wasn't you riding for him during the court? Now you changing up on him? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. Whose fault is it? Yours too, ma'am? And I know this is also partly my fault. Partly? Hmm. Let's ask your husband. Remember them yogurt nights that you miss? Sorry, but I gotta get going. Where is she going? Because she's a florist. As far as I'm concerned, you're unemployed, ma'am. All right, Tournament of Roses. Pasadena, California. I don't know why I heard them say Pasadena the whole time, but for whatever reason, Callie didn't click in my mind. Vanessa Bloom, FTD. Speaking of uh, Cali, is anybody watching from Cali? Let me know where y'all from. Put it in the comment section or the live chat right now. I could be the princess and you yes, could be I think the pea. I got it. <laughs> He's like, I already knew where you were going with this. But that makes so much sense that a place like Cali would let something like this go to trial, 100%. We gotta give the bees rights. Would you remove your shoes and everything in your pockets? Enjoy your flight. So this must have been before TSA because he really didn't check him. Is it John Travolta a pilot? Yes. Wait, is John Travolta really a pilot? I didn't know that, but I guess that makes sense because he has a jet and an airplane at his house. So did y'all see like the, the little layout of his house? Come on, technically a bee shouldn't be able to fly at all. The wings are too small. Yeah, and they started off the movie saying that same thing too. So at this point, I know it by heart. But let me tell you something about a small job. If you do it really well, it makes a big difference. Yeah, you see? This this the whole uh, size doesn't matter thing. That's what this debate is. Forget Hover. You know what? This isn't so hard. Beep, beep, beep. Okay, so is there anything that this girl can't do besides save her marriage? Hmm? Now I she flies planes? We like, come on. Pilot that whole time. Okay, I was about to say, that's why she's able to fly it. It turns out I cannot fly a plane. Okay, man, we don't got time for you to get attitude. This plane is gonna go down, so you need to figure it out. You have got to snap out of it. <gasps> you snap out of it. You <laughs> Wait, are they really? They're pimp slapping each other right now? While the plane is falling out the sky? Snap out of it. You snap out of it. Bro, they're still going. No way. It's been three whole minutes. Oh, they got a kink. Pollen jocks. They do get behind a fellow. They get behind a fellow? And do what? Don't get behind me. Uh-uh. I don't play that. <laughs> what? This is the, the end of Footloose? Yeah, like that many bees will be able to control that big old airplane? I doubt it. How does she automatically know how to sh shut off the engine anyways? First of all, it looks like she's coming in way too fast. That? That's a fat guy in a flat. Oh my goodness. Come on. And why is he walking? They shouldn't be allowed to just walk out there like that. That's dangerous. Pull reverse. Easy, just drop it. Be a part of it. So are the bees gonna move out the way before they land? Or are they just gonna land on top of the bees? Woman! Oh, okay, I was about to say. 
Ooh, that'd be way too many bees on one spot for me though. All right, whew, I get the heebie-jeebies. Shout out to Gina Rodriguez. Come on already. Yo, that is the worst part. Like when you land and you just have to sit there and wait for them to finally like uh, take off the seatbelt sign. I'm a pollen jock and it's a perfect fit. All I gotta do with the sleeves. Hey, I like this song. Do, 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 do. Hey, hey, hey. Here comes the sun. Okay, who sings this song? This is one of those songs that you hear and you automatically get happy for no reason. It's all right. It's okay. Hey, hey, do, 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, maybe it's called Here Comes the Sun. But is she the original singer? I thought a dude sung this song, but I could be mistaken. One thing that DreamWorks doesn't miss on is their um, soundtracks for their movies. Like, they always pick the right songs. Hey, this is a perfect song to play, too. While the flowers are coming back to life. It's crazy what a little bit of pollen can do, you know? That'd be jacking up my allergies. That's what I do know. Anybody else got allergies? If y'all got allergies, let me know in the comment section. Put it down below. Every time the season change, it jacks me up immediately. Like, as soon as the like temperature starts to shift just a little bit, I'm sick for at least a day or two. Uh, right Would you like some honey with that? It is oh, of course. Now she's selling honey. I've never been to a florist that had honey. Cheese, it's all me. And I don't see a nickel. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That's so funny. Sometimes I just feel like a piece of meat. Oh, you are. You definitely are. Sorry I'm late. My boy came back. <laughs> Shout out to him. Just leave it to me. You're a lifesaver, Barry. Can I help who's next? It almost doesn't even look like she was looking at him. Oh, that bee is living my life. <laughs> No way, you lost your wife to a bee? Come on. Look at my boy finally living his dream. He said he don't want to be no NPC. That wasn't the life for him. Interesting movie. I'm just glad that they she didn't end up with a bee like they were in love. I really thought that's the direction they were gonna go, so. Woo! Glad that's not the case. Okay, so that was the bee movie, and I want y'all to know, towards the end of the credits, they had a thinking bee song, which was a boppery. I can't play it for y'all because of copyright, but just know, I did listen to some of it, and I enjoyed it. It was a really good song. But this movie is interesting. Like, it came out in 2007. How old were you in 2007? Like, what? I was 14 years old in 2007. 14, so it makes sense why I never came across this or why I didn't watch it at that point. Um, going into them good old teenage years and worrying about other things than animated movies, I guess. Because I, I never even knew that this movie existed, for real, for real. But anyways, if you guys enjoyed this movie commentary, give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below what movie you want to see you do next with the hashtag Bingers, B-I-N-G-E-R-S. And I get to it whenever I get to it. I really do appreciate y'all love and support. I still hope that you guys are staying hydrated. Thank y'all so much for rocking with me. When I tell y'all that I love each and every single one of y'all, I really mean that. I really do from the bottom of my heart. Anyways, that'll do it until my next movie commentary. I will see y'all then. Billy Binges. Oh!